Hey guys, welcome back to Design Junkie 58 where we do reviews on mocks, videos, and other cool creations. And today, guys, I am proud to announce another review coming to you. And today's special is on, that's right, the Power Functions Elements. This video is going to be geared towards beginners on the Power Functions basics um, with the generic motors and stuff. And uh, LEGO has released, uh, I believe, you know, two years ago, um, some newer upgrades to the Power Functions lineup. Uh, so I'll be introducing those to you today. And you might already be familiar with this, guys, so just, uh, it, you know, if this is familiar to you, then, you know, feel free not to watch this, but, you know, this is going to be beneficial to those who are really trying to get into the actual Technic Power Functions motor stuff, because this is basically how you power all your uh, creations. Um, so, now, keep in mind, I don't actually have all the actual motors here. I just have a selection of them. For example, I don't have the RC buggy motor. That's the big black motor with two outputs. Um, uh, don't have that motor here today. Um, I will be introducing or showing you a smaller motor from 2006. It's really old. It's not part of the Power Functions lineup at all. It's this little guy right here. Um, uh, yeah, this thing just is terrible, honestly. I mean... It really sucks. I mean, the motor is like doesn't even work anymore. So um, this one on the old uh, uh, Creator uh, helicopter model, I reviewed a couple of videos back. I'll put a link up there for that. And uh, but yeah, this motor is just terrible. I mean, it makes a horrible screeching sound when you turn it on. But it's cool because you can see all the internal stuff on it, and it actually has a power supply that looks like this. So it resembles really, really closely to the uh, Power Functions battery box. Uh, it's got the same dimensions and all, but the power outlet plug is different. And the actual cables for this, or for uh, the the old motor, uh, looks like this. I mean, the, the cables don't even work with this. Now, the good thing Power Functions has done, actually, is they've actually enabled a cord. I don't actually have it here to show you, which is a bummer. But it actually has a plug that looks like this. And um, one of these outlets right here. It's sort of an adapter plug, and it actually enables you to use the older motors with the Power Functions system. So that actually is really cool. Um, now, aside from the older motors, which are just junk, at least this motor is... The buggy motor is really wicked cool. I wish I could afford that, but uh, I'll have to invest in that in a later time. Anyway, moving forward, uh, let's just move all this off the t off the uh, box here, and uh, I'll just start showing you all the motors and uh, power functions uh, gadgets that LEGO has released over the years. Okay, now to start off, uh, power functions when it was introduced in around 2007 with the release of the uh, Technic uh, 8275 Bulldozer. And uh, that set was really popular and actually helped boosted the Power Functions uh, popularity. So I'm going to set the camera down right now. And uh, I'll just put the stuff right here for you guys. So starting off, we have our basic uh, battery box power uh, source. Uh, it requires uh, six AA batteries to power this bit, to power this bad boy. And your power source has a green light that signals that it's actually turned on. And a power outlet plug. And uh, you can attach it with these holes here or with these babies right here. So that's that. The simplest way to power a model is with a motor. This actually happens to be the medium motor or the M motor as I like to call it. And what you can do to power this thing is just simply attach it on like that. Turn it on, and that that little guy's just gonna spin. So this is a really one of the basic motors that Lego has released uh, since its uh, inception, and uh, it's really just a cool motor. So, in addition to that motor, that really complements this motor is the XL motor. This motor is the big boy, the big horse of the whole Power Functions lineup. It uh is really loud and has m the most torque out of all of them. So 
so it is just a really really cool motor guys um, I'm gonna actually have to cut the video short here now guys because I'm running out of battery juice so I would say stay tuned in for the part two of the power functions review